Yes, guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks very much for checking out today's content. And I'm with a good friend of mine, Peter Finch, and we're at Dundonald Links up here on the west coast of Scotland. And we're going to do a little course vlog. We're going to play three holes and we're going to be talking through every shot. Now, it's got a bit of a twist because points wise, we're going to play stable for points. So, as I'm sure you already know, two points for a par, one point for a bogey. Three points for a birdie, just in case. <laughs> you, never, you, never <laughs> you never know. know. <laughs> you never know. And today's concept is you've got to call your shot. If you call the shot and you don't get the shot correct, you'll be deducted a point. <laughs> so this could be the first ever match of Stableford points that ends in minus. <laughs> I, honestly, as a coaching video, I mean, everybody watching, this should give you some really, really good info on how to shape shots and play different types of goal shots. But at the same time, for us, after how we played yesterday on our first game up here, this is going to be horrific. Yesterday was a long car journey. It was we got bad bags. It was a long round of golf there's as well. A, Everything was long yesterday. There's a few injuries floating around, so we're not going to use them as excuses until we've hit the bad shots. I will. Yeah, fair. I so will. I, I was I'll use that as an excuse halfway through the shot. <laughs> From top, <laughs> top of the back swing, yeah. Right, so we're going to get started. We're on the fifth hole, par five, dog leg left. We're going to play the next three holes. Pete. Do you want to lead us away? Yeah. Is it? Are we calling our own shots, or are you like? No, no, no. You can call your own shots. Okay. It's hard, that's hard enough. Yeah. So I'm gonna have three holes of fade in it. <laughs> and you can't play the same shot twice. New rule. Made it up. <laughs> are there that many shots? <laughs> are there that many shots that exist? It shouldn't do. Well, I mean, this is a it's a dogleg right to left, isn't it? So let's try and hit a draw. This is your draw. Okay. Uh, with a driver. So. <laughs> I want my path, so I want the path the club to take to be a little bit more out to the right through impact. And then I want my club face to be close to that path and yet remaining slightly open to impact. Now, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the way that I hear that people do this in the textbooks is I'm going to set myself up and I'm going to aim the club at, there's basically like a little tree just on its own out in the distance, which isn't very precise, is it? But kind of over this little post. So I'm gonna aim my club at that. And then I'm just gonna move my feet slightly to the right of that. So my path is traveling further right than my club face aim. And then just gonna swing out to the right. And hit a draw. Wow. That was, that was, I mean, I'll be honest, that was a lot better than I expected. It's actually perfect. Nice shot. <laughs> I don't know uh, who's editing this, but <laughs> that was the T-mark. Another way, if you want to actually hit a draw, is hit it so far out of the toe, because <laughs> gear effect actually shapes it to the left. I wasn't going to say it was a massive Hey, draw. you leave me alone. <laughs> it's early in the morning. It was like a quick draw, wasn't it? I mean, it was bordering it on a hook. It wasn't a shapey draw, it was it a It was draw. bordering on a hook, but it still moved right to left. So I'm right, gonna... because you've drawn it, I'm going to go fade, okay. all right? So fade for me, there's a left, there's a bunker there on the left-hand side. I'm going to aim just right at that with the club face, but I'm going to set my feet in towards this left rough. There's a little post here. That's my feet line. So club face is slightly open to feet, and I'm going to try and feel like the swing stays the same to make sure I don't roll the face. I've got a very bad habit of doing that. Mm. Now that's in my head, I'm going to probably slice it. So feet left, club face not as far left, normal swing. And we get what oh, we technically to called. Down. Huh? Well, it's a quite a nice kick. It's a bit rough over there, though. It was a bit rough, wasn't it? Yeah. It wasn't as many bounces as I expected. Mm. But that was called a push slice. I was going to say, I mean, are, are we being nice to each other? I or mean, I, are we I, like. I wouldn't dock me a shot for that. Because it's the first hole, okay. But if we were. By the time we get to the last hole and there's actually something on it. But end of the day, ball move left to right. Yeah, but a lot. Like, <laughs> that was a big move left to right. And you missed the fairway. You toe hooked it. I've hit the fairway. I've hit a perfect shot. Toe hook. All right, Finchy, 260. Wasn't the best drive. Downwind. Bit of dog leg right still to go. So I'm going to hit, I'm going to get a three iron draw out of the rough. Okay. Now, I feel like I'm going to lose a point here. I'm just. Does it have to be a shape? Can I hit a straight shot? Um. Yeah, but it has to be very straight if you're going to try and pull that. <laughs> like, I, I'm, I'm going to be quite harsh. Right, okay. I've got the, I've got the draws going today then. Out the rough? Yeah. Is that wise? No. 
not, so you're what not would, scared it's going to like have a quick pull it's left got it's got i've the, actually i've actually got a great lie to be fair i feel like the fade's the one but i know there's a lot of danger left i lost yeah. two balls in there yesterday yeah i'm not i didn't so, want to actually say anything but <laughs> i didn't want, i don't really want to go over there's there there's a again. ball graveyard to the left of this hole so it's going to be a very very light draw it's, just, it's going to be as good as straight to be honest like a bit of a diet draw a, a diet draw so we're yeah. not going full fat god okay. one of them right okay little diet draw yeah i think new the, lingo coming soon i think the only thing extra people need to worry about out of the rough is just if it flips over quick so a bit of a stronger grip as far as like pressure wise yeah i often go a little bit more over on the right hand weaken it weaken it a touch yeah, as well. i weaken it a touch if this because the lie is not too bad i won't do it too much now but when you get a tough lie and it snags up and goes left slightly weaker grip with the right hand feels horrendous mm. but can help stabilize the face okay but obviously do that in moderation can't wait to see this little slice in <laughs> all right this is going to be 263 iron diet draw Hold on. That's, that, that was pretty awesome. That was a great draw. I, it's just if it's gone too far left, but I don't think it has. No. Diet draw, high, three iron. I should get an extra point for that. Mm, we'll see. <laughs> Let's just see if we can find it. And it's middled as well. It's 245 to the middle of the green, over Heather. It's hard to kind of picture a shape of shot, to be fair, when you can't see where you're really going. Yeah, the only thing I remember from here yesterday is that before the green it kind of slopes down and from right to left so i'm going to hit like a little bit of a lower shot to try and get a bit of a chase oh so i'm going to go over the middle of the bush yeah and i'm just going to try keep it low not really much shape but we're going for a, a lower shot here okay a, a low diet shot. draw low diet draw well now i'm not going to draw it too much i'm going to it's going to be quite straight so remember it's got to be straight quite straight a quite straight low <laughs> shot that's what we're going for kids so twist it a little bit lower i've got a 19 degree hybrid here now normally this would be kind of forward in my stance but i'm just going to move it back a touch so i'm going to take a little step on my left foot a tiny bit more on my right just so it's forward of center i'm going to put a little bit more weight on my left side i'm just going to hold that weight left i'm just going to try and get my hands finishing a little bit lower around my body. Well, it's just come out a bit right. Should have aimed my body a bit left there. Well, I mean, it was, it was, it was okay. It was just a bit of a bail, wasn't it? It was a, it was a low push yeah. slice. So, so basically we've docked him a shot. What? No, he came out <laughs> low. I didn't say, I didn't say it was going to be straight-ish. I, I, Gave myself a little bit of leeway there. Come here. The heather's there. The ball's over there. No, right, okay, for a start, that's a gorse bush, it's not heather. So I'm going to dock you a point on your <laughs> botanical expertise. <laughs> and these went pretty low. Right, okay, only because it's the first hole, I'll dock you half a point. Exactly. After your, <laughs> after your push slice. No, it's no dock points. No. Cheat. <laughs> the, uh, we're in the driving seat now. Yeah, mine's a little bit tight. Well, as you can't see it, so it's in the rough. The long stuff. So that was just lack of knowledge on the golf course rather than a bad shot. <laughs> <laughs> and yet here I am with a perfectly fine ball. After a push slice. Shut up. <laughs> right. at, least it, at least it was low. <laughs> nah. what's, the, what's the shot? I like these ones now. Are we going in high? Are we going in soft? Are we going in low? Fast, uh, bungee? We're going to go in relatively high, and because the ball's so far above my feet, I'm going to just aim. See where like the fairway cross into the semi-rough? But yeah. So yeah. Gonna, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. I'm going to aim there because the ball's so far above my feet, and my hands, as my hands drop lower, the toe's going to come up. That's going to point the face a little bit more off to the left. Nice. So right, right. I'm Good. effectively going to pull this. Yes. So that's my shot shape. Okay. Pull. Okay. Any adjustments to set up? Um, just going to aim slightly further right. I'm going to stand a little bit taller than usual, but apart from that, no. Ball position is going to stay central. I don't want to faff around with that. If I move it too far forward, it's going to go back over my left shoulder, bit. so. Well, 
Well, that's a good shot, Pete. Decent, yeah. That's a very good shot. It, it always works though when you talk yourself through shots a it bit. It does. Like, it does. That's why it's so important. I think that's why caddies like really work on tour. It's just because you got someone to like. Oh, Pete, that's close as well. Let's play go, on, play. Let's go find my ball. <laughs> okay, so to be fair, we found it eventually. It's not that bad, but if you're playing this hole, don't go over the header or the gorse so or whatever it's called. Finchy is in super, super close. Just thought I'd uh, grab the phone and come up here and show you the result of my shot. Thank you. Thank you very much. So I need to get up and down somehow. Just There's a big there. ridge about halfway yep. up the green, which the aim is to try and land it on there. Obviously from this type of line, with grass getting stuck between ball and club, it will release and it's linked and it's fast and it's downwind, so it's going to be quite a fast shot. So, I've got to try and get a decent connection on the ball. Lies not that bad. Ball position is going to be in the centre, so I can hit down the ball. Body weight is going to be in the left side. Hands slightly forward, so everything gives it that descending blow. About halfway up the green and it will release. That needs to sit. Oh, it's just... Bye-bye. Bye-bye. And it's gone. See you later. Ah. <laughs> nice birdie, Peter. That gimme? You can have that one. Three points. Yeah, three points in the bag. It's no big. It's no big. It's fine. It's fine. No, stop. <laughs> stop. So I need an up and down. I like how you've not brought your putter over, that's confidence. I'm gonna chip it close. Wow, okay. I forgot it. <laughs> right. It's not easy. Higher, soft landing, good lie. Club face ever so slightly open. Add a bit of loft for impact. Ball position, front foot. Soft feet. Soft feet. Not too bad. And that is why I should have brought a putter. That's pretty <laughs> good. I thought that was going to... That's give me range. That's not give me range for a broom handle putter. <laughs> Going this for a nice solid par. It's ballsy. Two points. Well done, mate. <laughs> Very good. Could have been worse. That could have been a lot worse. Especially if I'd have missed that, you were never going to give me that. Oh no, of course I wasn't <laughs> ever going to give you it. No chance. <laughs> Don't miss from there. <laughs> Whew. What's that? 141 into the breeze. 141 into wind. Into a stiff, cold wind. Is it my honour, Your Honour? This is your honour, the birdie man. 140, well, I'm thinking a little, just a little eight iron that just, it kind of just drifts to the right. Okay. It kind of like falls to the right, like okay. a long day at work and you just get to the couch and you're like, oh, okay. like that. So I not can like relate, a, I can relate. Not like a swerve, I know, I thought you'd appreciate that. Yeah. So <laughs> I need to have a bit more of a think about, well, this as far as explanation goes, because <laughs> it's just like my shape. <laughs> so maybe I'll talk through a little bit more about how I see the shot yeah. and how I kind of feel it. So I, I like to just see the shot, imagine how much it's going to fade. So I use reference points. So the right hand side of the bunker by the green, I see it starting there and then just slowly drifting to the right. Now the way I play fades, I basically aim at the point that I want it to start and then I get the feeling that it's going to drift. Yeah. And that's, it's as simple as that. I don't want to like overcomplicate yeah, it too much. The rest is more your swing, isn't it? Yeah, and it's more just like trusting the feel of yeah. it. Yeah, you're, you're not changing yourself to hit that shot. That's just your shot. Yeah, yeah. So I've got my aim point here. So line from edge of the bunker back to the ball. It's just inside that old divot there. Eight iron center of the stance. Set my feet around that point. And then just swing and let it drift back. Oh, I've just done it too much. 
Ooh. It's all right. Just started a bit right. Started out the flag with the drift. That was a bit of a, it took a bit of a weird kick as well, but that's on this hole, we know from yesterday, miss right. Don't, <laughs> don't miss left on this hole. Well, who missed left? Well, as Carter knows on this one, actually, don't, don't hit the ground six inches behind the ball. <laughs> Where's uh, that divot gone? Not that you need to be reminded of that. <laughs> what are you going to hit here, though? Right, mate? so I've got, I've got a nine iron, which, actually, I'm going to take it off the tee, because the tee, I get a bit spinny off the tee. Interesting. So I'm going to put a nine iron just back of centre, and just kind of feel like the hands are staying forward, lower body's clearing. I'm just going to drill it. Okay. 99 for me is about 155 and this is 140. So that wind shouldn't be really doing too much. Okay. I'm going to be quite an astute judge here of if it's a drilled shot, by the way. Well, it's a 99 for me, it's not going to go super low. No. It's all about the trajectory. Okay. It's the how it gets there. We've got witnesses as well. So we're going to have a, like a group decision on if this is a low okay. drilly one. This is going to be nice. You're going to enjoy this. Yeah, it's a nice shot. I, I'm low I, I, to I'm, a high peak. I'm willing. I'm willing to say that it was more of a drilly shot because you seemed to execute everything how you, you wanted to. Exactly. But that was just a normal ball flight for you. For me, that was just a normal that ball. Was, flight. I live in Dubai where I have to hit it to the moon to keep the ball up in the air as long as possible. So okay. to me, that was head height. So I'm not... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Fair however, enough. you, however, by the way, we, we, you missed your target by 25 yards. Uh, I think you'll find I'm leading in the match. You're a point down on this hole, though. Wow. This is fun. Right. Because you lost a point... How did I lose a point? Because you lost a point off the tee. If you How did I lose a point off the tee? If you execute this shot, I'm willing to give it you back. That is absolute BS, by the Cause way. Because we're talking about we're talking about missing the green, okay. course management, missing the green in the correct place. Right. Okay. So, so a better place would have been the bunker. Like your first two shots, on the first hole, like they were, they were good then, right? They were good. I'm just uh, just making sure we know the rules. So that push slice off the first that you don't get a doctor point for. Interesting. Right. Look, look how defensive he is. He's so right. defensive. If, that, if that's the way you want to play so, this game, that's so the way we'll play the game. Competitive. Guys, comment below. Okay, my, I hit two good shots. Okay, I just didn't know my way around the actual hole. Finchie's push sliced it by mm. 25 yards on a part three with an eight iron. A bit tricky, this one. Right, talk me through it. It's hard. If you get this inside six foot, you can have your shot back. I'm going to say, because I need to like basically almost kill this in the fringe before the green. Ooh. Get it to the top and then let it ride down. This is tricky because I, I just don't know how it's going to react out of that. But I can see the shot. Just pitching <laughs> just before the green. Pop, pop, just rolls up Ooh. down to the right. I don't see that shot. Oh, I just... That was literally a foot too short, wasn't it? It just, the first, it just like checked up. You know what? That's the thing though. I don't see that shot. I cannot see that shot at all. I am like, I'm thinking soft, floppy hands, a little bit of height to about here, a little bit of release, and then off it goes. Nah, nah, you're losing Amazing it. Amazing how you see different shots, isn't it? Uh, Neither of us can pull them off, but. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a shame. Oh, well. It was a good effort. I won't dock you a point for that. Yeah, it's, it's just... Yeah. It was a tricky one, but I, I used a lob wedge. I, I should have used a pitch wedge, maybe, but... I no, see, a pitch wedge just comes out even faster, though. Yeah, well, that's what I needed I think lob wedge bit. is the right shot. But I would say that. I use it for everything. <laughs> All right, up the hill, left to right. Miss on, the, miss on the low side, you get a doctor shot. I actually don't know which side the low side is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. I'd say you missed on the high side. That was a nice putt. Oh. Par, par, start. Steady away, you know. 
steady are you? Oh, Jesus mean? Christ. <laughs> super, super steady. <laughs> I was the opposite of steady. All right. Right to left, big swinger. Oddly enough, my nickname in high school. <laughs> and through college. <laughs> Good job, I the L, by the way. Yes. That was absolutely flying. <laughs> nice part, Pete. Thank you. Scores are level. <laughs> now then, guess what I'm playing with today? Oh, you got the one dogs. Back in college, this went missing. <laughs> and it was judged to have been stolen. And we were correct by him. Since he's just full of crap. Wait, since, since, since the age of eighteen, you're oh. literally just making it up. You had these two one irons at Trafford. No, I bought. This was eight years after college. I lost it in college as well. I think. See, <laughs> maybe maybe I got it back from somebody else. Oh, you this stole is, it at some point. This anyway, is, this <laughs> is in pro this is the biggest problem the world has today. This kind of fake news, and you're perpetuating it. Okay, I, I, I'm not even joking anymore. This is really serious. So you now. stole it at work. Yes. <laughs> right, At then. least get my feth correct. <laughs> Feels quite weird because I got a new shaft in the other one. Oh, yeah. Right. Is that X1, is it? Or? This, this, is, this is S3. S3, yeah. So, that's fine. I'll make it work. Are you going to have to play your filthy stinger with it? I'm going to play to the tractor. Yeah. I'm going to go left of that about head height. Like it. Okay. Do it. Not do hit it. this. Do it. Get I'll it. hit this for a get while. Get it, get it. Oh. Oh. And then you've got to do the same. No. <laughs> it's a nice shot. You've That's clearly a that, that was pure. You've clearly lost the ability to hit a ball low, but that was nice. That was a nice shot. That was pure, wasn't it? Wasn't, it? it but it wasn't a stinger. Yes, it was. For a one iron, that was a high ball flight. Yeah, I mean, like, listen, listen, you've just hit a one iron. That should have been like scaring moles here to about 200 yards away. No, but it's got to rise at some point because I need the distance. I, I got a nice combination of height and roll. You lost your mind. Right, I'm going to... What are you going to do then? don't know yet. Uh, what have we got? Driver. Yeah. Do you want to one iron? Do you want to try it at one iron? Yeah. All right, now we're going to see a low stinger. Oh, I don't know. Probably, probably thin it. In all fairness, yeah, that <laughs> would work. <laughs> it's quite good, actually. Like, audio on videos, it, it's difficult to pick up a thin. So you can kind of just... We'll be able to see finish. from your reaction of the pain. Yeah. <laughs> the way I hit my stinger, I'm going to grip it a little bit harder, I'm going to try and bow the wrist through impact Ooh. and get the hands like there. Wow, okay. Like See, I tried that a little bit, but I'm scared of going left. So I just bullet one straight instead. Oh, tractor. Ball position just back in middle. Oh, <laughs> with a push. I kind of struck that well. Sit down. It's all right, but oh, I struck that amazing as well. Did you? Yeah, but he's just gone 40 <laughs> yards right sideways. <laughs> Look at the difference. Some people can do it, some can't. Okay? Mate, Whatever about hit, trajectory, just... talent always prevails. You just hit a normal shot. Do I hit, do I hit? Do I... I hit a normal shot. You just hit a normal shot. You didn't sting it. You just hit a normal shot. No extra points have taken away, though. Yeah, Pete Stinger was good, though, wasn't it? Full right. <laughs> Why are you so mean to me? Mmm, <laughs> we have a predicament. Yeah. Like, loads and loads of grass behind the ball. Uh, so what I'm going to do, Ooh. even though it seems slightly controversial... Yeah, it does, but I like the idea. Could use the hybrid. You go. Yeah. So if you're in thick rough, like something you see like a lot of the pros do now as well on tour, because like a hybrid or a seven wood, it's got loads of loads of surface area on the bottom. 
this kind of glides through the grass a little bit easier and then I can kind of cling on. So you almost want to use this hybrid. I'm aiming to basically hit slightly before the ball and just let the club slide through. It's going to come out with pretty, not a lot of spin, but I'm like 210 yards away. Pitch it just before, let it roll up. It's going to bounce slightly right. And it's going to camber slightly to the left when it gets on the green. Leave me for a birdie. Sorry, I just got lost in the moment. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot everyone's here then. I apologise. <laughs> right. <laughs> Let's see if any of that works. Wind's a little bit off the left, but... Don't worry about that. It's just a... Oh, Pete. That's come out so well. I that's come out too well. Just left of the green, but... It's kind of... It's on the edge. Just did stuff. It's all right, though. I won't punish you for that. Oh, you won't punish me for a good <laughs> shot? That's so nice. <laughs> <laughs> you know that shot that you described before where you just start it left and just see it fall? Yeah, yeah. I can't do that, but I'm going to try it. No, I, I've kind of seen you do that every now and again. Yeah, it generally depends what side of bed I wake up on. Sometimes you've got a bit of a stiff back, I can get a fade. Well, I mean, this morning you got out of the left side of the bed, so. How do you know? It was a, <laughs> I was, it was a shame to see you go. <laughs> hey, listen, it's cold up here in Scotland. We need to conserve our body weight. <laughs> right. Wind's off the left. That's why it's going to drop left. <laughs> nine, nine, 150, straight at it. Perfect yardage. Okay. Let's try and keep a clear head. Don't try and think of all those images that might just be going through your mind. That's <laughs> the main thing. That's pretty straight, really. A little bit of drop to the right, pin high. It's quite similar, actually. You kind of just started a bit right and then just fell a bit further right. Just a slight, slight push by a couple of degrees maximum. Yeah, but a couple of degrees over 150 yards means a 30-foot miss. You've got to be more precise. Birdie putt. I've got a birdie putt, Peter. <laughs> it's still a novelty to Carter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of obsession with it. Be aggressive, into wind, bit of spin. I like these shots. Oh. It's one of those which is like sat like on top of the rough. Oh, it's like too good of a lie. Yeah. So it's gonna to have to be kind of swept off the top, which probably will increase the spin, the Isle of Aaron in the background. What a hole this is. God, it gets me so excited. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna hit kind of halfway up the green, roll it up, a little bit left to right. How can you not be inspired by that background? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it looks lovely. West coast of Scotland, man. It's amazing. Right. So halfway up the green. Nice and tall. The top. Go, 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 go. It's just... It's just uphill in here, just needed a bit more. Just landed about a third rather than a half. Good shot. Yeah, it's all right, it's all right. Yeah. Almost again. For me, good shot for me. Up, uphill right to left. This is going. I'm, I'm six points ahead. This is not according to the leaderboard. <laughs> oh, yeah. This, this Carter, <laughs> Carter controls the leaderboard. <laughs> right, this is dropping in. Right to left, up the hill. That was a good effort. Oh. That was a good effort. Hey, Literally take. that much pace, it goes in. Take it away, mate. That's uh, good for me. So this for the win then, eh? This for the... This to half the match. <laughs> Unbelievable. I don't think the audience will appreciate the fact you just make this up as you go along. It's shocking, Why actually. not? <laughs> I think they will. <laughs> well, I'm going to count this as a win when this drops. In my mind. Let's see then. Is it left or right though? It's got to be, hasn't it? Just a smidge. Left, left to right. Yeah. 
Wow. He's never been left to right. <laughs> oh, that's a... Uh, He's never been left to right. That was a... Uh, Pete, <laughs> you've not quite woken up yet. <laughs> that's just like complete brain fart, that. What planet is that left to right? That was left edge. No, it's not. Look, it's finished directly behind the hole. Admittedly, it's six foot behind the hole, but... Look at the speed you put it in at. There you go. Left edge. Perfect. Right, that was a tiny bit right to left. <laughs> that was right a to left. A tiny bit right to left. That was right to left all day. Yeah, you've been smoking some of you. Right. right, this two only lose by one. This to half. <laughs> it's a good putt, though. That's gone right to left. See, it was left to right. Yeah, that's right. They're both right to left. Oh, fuck it. They're both right to left. Yeah, they don't have to be opposite. They're both right to left. This moves that right to left. That makes literally no sense. How are they both right to left? Again, a smidgen of right to left. Oh, I'm having this pot again. This one's one that counts. <laughs> a smidgen of right to left. Do you yeah. know when you stand like that with, the, with that putter? See? See how it went right to left on you? A little bit to begin with, yeah, to be fair. Yeah, yeah. Oh, did you hear that? Oh, anyway, good half, mate. Well played. Good win. Good half, mate. Well played. <laughs> good half. I enjoyed that. Good half. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, thank you very much for watching. Massive thanks to Dun Donald Links. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. It's a bit of a it's a nice way to kind of try and talk through your shots. Yeah, it'll so always if play you can, you If do. you can play and talk through your shots, maybe not to the extent that we ramble on, but <laughs> talk about it. I'm speaking, I'm speaking on behalf of you. Don't know what you mean. <laughs> no, if you can play golf and talk yourself through a shot, see a shot, visualize a shot, you're more likely to be closer to what you're trying to do. Yeah. Definitely. Oftentimes you just get to you get to the idea, oh 150, a time and hit it. And you don't really think enough about the shot. I'm not saying go into massive detail, but a little bit more detail than what you probably usually would. Give it a try and it will make your shots a little bit tighter, a little bit better. A little bit... I can't disagree with any of that, to be honest with you. Well, that's, you know what, that's all I want. I think that's the most sense you've ever spoken. I like that, I'll take that. I've known you for 30 years. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I, was trying to, I was trying to do the maths then, but we know me. No, 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 I mean, no, no. we'll, we'll, we'll Just, stick with 30, we'll yeah. stick with 30. Guys, thanks for watching. Please do hit the, the like button. Please do subscribe to the channel. Pete, thanks for coming on. Always a pleasure to no beat problem, you. Mate. See you again. Half. That was a half. <laughs> Halfed it. One Both point, level par. One it. point victorious.